Professors Higgs and Englert, two of the men behind the Higgs boson, the elusive particle that explained how the universe got mass, came to Parliament on Tuesday. Professor Higgs, after whom the particle is named, first identified the boson in 1964, but it wasn't until earlier this year that scientists identified a particle that was consistent with Higgs's theory. They spoke to MEPs and took part in a live web chat, underlining the importance of scientific research. There are uh, what one called applied science, there's fundamental science. One should invest in both, of course, but one should be careful to invest in things which has effect on long distance. With budget cuts dominating the headlines, the latest programme to face the guillotine was 100 billion euro Horizon 2020. MEPs approved it and have cautioned against any cuts. They say Europe must invest to stay competitive. In the Horizon 2020 we are covering the whole cycle of innovation in order that uh, we help this passage from the scientific results until product systems and that we have production um, in Europe. Parliament on Tuesday voted in favour of free trade agreements with both Colombia and Peru. It already has similar agreements with Mexico, Chile and South Korea. The new deal will open up markets on both sides and, more importantly, giving the EU better and cheaper access to raw materials. It's a part of the world that will be much closer to us, uh, to where we can export more, from where we can import more as well. Uh, without, uh, without duties, uh, so it's a beneficiary both for the economies on both sides and also for the citizens, for the consumers, uh, because we are going to pay less for the same uh, items.